Hello everyone, and welcome fellow Minecraftians to another Minecraft tutorial. Today I'll be showing you how to install the TV mod made by the Rainbow Guy. I believe this mod was first developed by Paranite, but he discontinued it, so the Rainbow Guy got permission to develop it for the latest version of Minecraft. So it's a pretty awesome mod and I would recommend it. And to be honest, this is one of the first mods that I actually found really hard to install, but Believe me, if you follow this tutorial step by step, it should work. If you run into any errors or problems, you can comment or send me a message and I will help you personally. And yeah, let's get started. You need WinRAR or 7-Zip for this. You can check for that in the description. It's an archiver to open the files that we're going to download. And yeah, so you're going to need Mod Loader, Zuggler, which is a software you need for this mod, and the actual mod file. And I found that you can't really play movie files which are not WMV otherwise Java tends to crash I'm not sure right now if he's gonna fix that but you can download the video converter here I will show you that later if you want but anyways so go to the mod loader link just click it right here it should take you to Rizugami's mods pardon me and scroll down to mod loader for the latest version and I'm just gonna download the direct one for tutorial purposes and to save time and then you wanna download the made mod from adfly you're gonna have to wait a few seconds I'm gonna skip the ad and then you want to download Zuggler but if you scroll down here you can check for the description to skip all of this but you will find a post by neon colors for the win 22 and you can thank him for this he made a thing as in Z Zuggle this program comes for 32 bit users and to f find out where your computer is you can go to computer right click properties and as you can see I'm 64 bit so you can download 32 bit and 64 bit just download this file right here in the description and whatever your version is if it's 32 bit you don't have to do anything but if it's 64 bit you have to patch it and I'll show you how to do that later okay there we go I have my three files here I'm just gonna go to my downloads and place them on my desktop I got mod loader right here I got the actual mod file and I got Zuggo, if that's how you even pronounce it. So anyways, what you want to do right now is go to your Minecraft folder, type in percent app data percent in your search bar and go to roaming folder and then open up your DOM Minecraft directory. Now go to your bin, go to your Minecraft jar and right click and open with WinRAR, 7-Zip or whatever iCarver you use. And if you have a meta INF folder, you need to delete it, otherwise this mod will not work. So delete your meta INF, that's crucial. Once you've done that, you can open up your mod loader file. And just copy and paste everything from mod loader and put it into your Minecraft jar. So just drag all the class files, everything into there. And TV mod, you want to open that up. And there's a folder to minecraft.jar. You can open that up and drag all its contents into your Minecraft jar. And I recommend making a uh, backup before you do this because sometimes people mess up and they get really upset so once you're done that you can close this go to your DOM Minecraft folder and over here it says to drag your TV properties into your DOM Minecraft directory okay so you're part way done now you actually need to install the actual software to do this so you can just click right here and you can just drag this to your desktop or something I already have it so you can run it Okay, and I just deleted the software so I can show you how to install it. You're going to click next here. You can agree. And I would recommend installing it for everyone because once I installed it just for me and it didn't show up later on. So install it for everyone on your computer. Install it right here and you got to wait a few seconds. Okay, now once that's done, you can click next and finish and you have it. So what you want to do right now is go to your computer. Go into your hard drive and go into program files by 86 only do this if you are 64 bit user using this 32 bit program if you're not you can just skip this step and I'll post an annotation and you can click it right now and you can skip ahead so anyways scroll down till you see the folder Zuggle in your software it should be in your program files by 86 open that up and now what you want to do is go and open up the zip file that you installed okay and you will see a folder called 64 bit patch files. Open that up and drag the three folders, not the README, into your 
new f your folder over here in program files and just make it merge just click yes and you can click move and replace and do it for all conflicts and you are done that part and then one more thing you need to do we can just close this you have to go into your lib folder and then go back to your minecraft jar and just select everything from this lib folder from your program files and drag it into your minecraft jar and then you are done installing the mod now if you want to put fold now if you want to open up minecraft right now this may take a few seconds okay now we are in minecraft i'm going to go to single player create a new world let's make it creative so i can access my inventory we're going to have to wait a few seconds and there we go so basically you guys have installed the mod oh my gosh sorry about that basically you guys have installed the mod but i'm going to show you how to set it up because a lot of people still run into errors in here so once you're done that you can open up your inventory after you make a little wall thing get your tv get your tv remote and you can right click and place down your tv over there and you can right click with your remote let me just put my sound as you can see it makes a little noise and that's basically changing channels and stuff and I do not have any movies in that's why I can't play anything so what you want to do is close minecraft and go back to your dot minecraft folder right here and go into resources go into mod go to TV and this is the folder where you put all your movies in and I found that files like mp4 do not work even though I think it's supposed to but it tends to crash people's Java and Minecraft you can try mp4 but I found that WMV always works so if you want to get your WMV file if you want to convert anything download this software which will be in the description it's pretty self-explanatory to download any video converter from CNET and it shouldn't take too long and then basically you can open it right here and you can get a file from YouTube or you can add a video file so I found this really retarded video of three retards dancing on the internet so I have it right here and over here is where you select what movie file you want so you want to click WMV and basically click convert now and that should take some time and it's done so it comes up here where to export it to I'm gonna drag it to my desktop so it's easier for me I'm gonna minimize that and I'm gonna drag it into my TV folder right here and basically that's how you do it so we're gonna open up Minecraft here and see if it worked okay single play go back into that world and we're going to place down my TV again and right click and there we go this is the video I have and as you can see it comes with sound too it may lag out a bit though so be aware of that this is a pretty retarded video anyways that's how you do it if you want to pause the video you just right click and it pauses if you want a different movie you hold shift and right click but obviously I don't have more than one and yeah you can check out the other commands on the forum page and I might create a minecraft mod showcase for this later anyways guys thanks for watching if this helped please leave a comment rate and subscribe it really helps us out thanks for y'all support anyways and yeah if you need help message me peace